almost time to hit the tanning booth. This thing, I got trash pick uh, lucky as the guy was pulling it out to the curb. I was like, are you actually uh, throwing that out? And the guy was like, yep, it's yours. And it fit in my van, barely. So yeah, I got this tanning blind so I can do my yoga without my neighbors gawking. And here is the Mylar Wonder. Um, I decided for 10 bucks it was going to be a cool experiment uh, to use these uh, Mylar sheets, three of them for $10. How can you go wrong? There's uh, two this way and then one on top this way and this part's a little shaky we'll see how it does in the wind and all uh probably gonna rip up and i can just trim it if i have to um but i wanted a little bit of uh covering for this because it tends to not do well in direct sunlight you can see how the the bottle is deformed from the heat because there's uh, the duct tape around uh, holding the screen on underneath and that black duct tape really soaks up the heat and if I'm actually going to get out which I'm planning to do uh, I have to think about the whole the long term structural integrity of the coroplast um probably wouldn't do so well in the direct sun for any length of time and the first clue i had about that was uh i went out on a hot summer day last year and this back panel started to deform so i just uh got a piece of, of wooden molding and um just taped it on there and that was enough to offset that but i don't want i don't want the whole thing to deform in the heat so i think that this uh this mylar is going to be a good solution and it's cheap compared to the next step up which is like a bubble laminated uh mylar so you can see that it's going to be a lot darker in there um and you can see how the various layers make a difference. It does allow, one sheet of mylar will allow light to come through. And um, even where it's tripled, you can see little specks that are making through here and there. So it's not a, uh, you can't expect one sheet to solve all your problems probably and um but this is a very light weight and easy solution we'll see how how it fares in the uh in at the hellish speeds of between 13 and uh 25 miles an hour generally okay thanks for looking